Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to do this eye makeup look using the new Urban Decay Vice 2 palette. So here's the little box and here's the actual Urban Decay Vice 2 palette. I wasn't sure if I was going to purchase this palette, but I just gave in and I purchased it. And the reason why I purchased it actually is because two of my friends have it, so I was like, okay, I need to have it. And the reason, actually, the reason why I bought it was because this pretty little lady talked to me into buying it, okay? Her name's Jackie, by the way. No, but in all seriousness, I really do enjoy this palette a lot. This is the second time I have used it, and I can't wait to use it plenty of more times. And if you guys have, or if you guys want to see more, um... Vice 2 palette looks then just let me know in the comments down below and also don't forget to thumbs up this video thumbs thumbs I just had a tongue twister thumbs up this thumb, thumb, oh my gosh never mind you know what I'm saying okay guys so I'll let you go so you can enjoy the tutorial peace okay so the first color that I'm gonna take is this color right here it's called dope and I'm gonna apply that to my highlight Okay, so Dope was a little bit too pink for me as a highlight, so I'm going to take my favorite highlight, which is Max Vanilla, and I'm going to apply it to on top of the Dope color to make it a little bit brighter. Okay, now I'm going to take a big fluffy brush and the color Habit, and I'm going to apply this color to the crease, and I'm also holding the brush right here at the very end. This is just going to be our transition color. Now I'm going to take the color Toxic, which is right here, and I'm going to apply this color with the Makeup Forever 226 brush. It's a synthetic brush, and it's actually going to pick up more of the glitter. Now I'm going to take the color Madness, which is a really nice blue. Is it this one? Yeah, wait, no. It's this one right here. I'm going to take it with a crease fluffy brush, and I'm just taking very little of this eyeshadow. And I'm going to apply this eyeshadow to the crease. I'm going to start by placing my brush at the outer part of the eye and bringing it in, in small circles. I'm not going to bring it all the way over here. I'm just going to stop about here. Now I'm just going to start to blend. And I'm also holding this brush at the very end because I don't want to add a lot of pressure. And I'm just going to wiggle outwards to make this little flick right here. I'm going to take a clean towel or tissue paper, whatever you want, and just clean that brush so you have like a nice clean blending brush. And you want to blend even more, just on the very edges, like right here on the inner part and on the edges of the shadow. Now I'm going to take this color right here, it's called Prank, with the same crease brush. I'm going to take very little, and I'm just going to apply it to the very outer V of the eye. So it's going to go from a darker blue to a lighter blue. I'm going to start by applying it right here one more time and bring it in, but don't take it as far as this blue. And I'm also going to bring it kind of downwards towards the lash line so it looks literally like a V. I'm going to take a little bit more. And I'm going to bring it down to the lash line. Okay, so as you can tell, I already have my eyeliners. Um, inside the waterline, I have Buxom's Call Me, and it's just a black eyeliner. And on top of the waterline, I have NARS. This is a really cool liner. It's not black, it's more of a blue. It matches kind of like these blues on the crease. And this one's called Atlantic. It's just a liquid liner. And I applied that on the lash line and I did a small wing. Now I'm gonna take the Buxom eyeliner one more time and I'm gonna apply it to the bottom lash lines. Now I'm gonna take a pencil brush and I'm gonna smudge it out. Now with the same pencil brush, I'm gonna take the color Love Love Sick, and it's just a really glittery black color. And because it does have some glitter, I'm gonna press it on the on top of the eyeliner. Now to complete the eyes, you just want to throw on some fake eyelashes. I prefer wispies because they look a lot more, 
I don't know, but they look better. Um, I have it on this eye right now. I'm about to apply it on this eye. Okay, and that's basically it for the tutorial. I'm just gonna go through real quick what I'm wearing on my face since I didn't show it in the tutorial. So for my foundation, I'm wearing my Elemesque Skin Base Foundation. For my concealer, I'm wearing just a Coastal Scents palette. Um, I don't know where it is. I think I just lost it. For my setting powder, I'm just wearing an e.l.f. HD setting powder. Okay, so for my bronzer, let me tell you what I'm wearing. I'm wearing Bahama Mama by The Balm. And I just found out that one of my local Walgreens carries it. And I was so excited. So I drove all the way over there. And it took me 30 minutes to drive over there. But yeah, just for this bronzer. And I really love it. I was running out of my Laguna bronzer. I, I'm almost out of it, so I needed a new bronzer, but I don't want to pay the $45 or $40. I don't know, but it's around that price. This was, this one was only $20, half the price, and I love it even better than Laguna. So this might be my favorite, favorite bronzer of all time. And for my blush, I'm wearing same old, same old Ella Masqua Lover Blush. I just can't get enough of this bl bl blush, so I think I'm going to make it like my number one favorite 2013 favorite blush for my lips i'm wearing this kate i don't know if it's kate moss or it just says kate it's by rimmel london and it's the number 14 i'm not sure i don't think they have a name for it but it's just this nude lipstick i'm not sure if i like it with this look so do you like this lipstick better or do you like this lipstick better? I actually like this one better with the whole look. I don't know. I'm the type of girl that likes to wear bright, bold lipsticks. And this one that I'm wearing is by Bite and I have been wearing it in my past like three or four videos. And it's the same one. It's Cassis Cases. It's just a really dark, vampy lip and I love it. Anyways, so I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. If you recreate this look, please follow me on Instagram and just um, tag me or whatever it is that you do on Instagram so I can see it. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, you're more than welcome to subscribe for future videos. Don't forget to thumbs up this video if you like this video and don't forget to also share with all of your friends. Thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you in my next video. Mwah, mwah.